Obedience is paramount. What? What do you want? <laughs> Seems your outburst has attracted some outside attention, brother. If it was an audience you wanted, you have it now. <clears throat> Please accept my apologies. I caught my brother attempting to do something unspeakable, and I could not contain my anger. Oh, yes, go on. Invite a total stranger into our family squabbles. This is no squabble, you pompous fool. What you have done today is abhorrent. I can forgive stealing my money, or pawning my valuables. What I cannot abide, however, is you attempting to sell Mother's urn with her remains still within. I was drunk, I did not know. All of those vases appeared the same. It is an urn, not a vase, you ignoramus. And you were the one who chose it when Mother passed away. I am tired of your shamelessness. And I am done bearing what should be your indignity. Do you hear me? I am done. You have gone too far this time, Amina. And I cannot bear the humiliation of being your brother any longer. I challenge you to a duel. Danica shall be my second. What? Are you mad? Borhal, are... are you sure? There is already so much death in the city. What good would this do? There has to be another way. Too late, Danica. He has issued his challenge. I accept. I, in fact, look forward to it. You. You shall be my second. Then it is settled. Outsider, you will work alongside Danica to prepare for the duel. As for you, Amila, enjoy these last few moments. For when we next meet, your shameful life ends. <laughs> Do not sound so confident, brother. Your family home is this way. Give me it the is not far. To do we can discuss the matters done. there. You will be working with me. As seconds, it is our duty to prepare for the duel and ensure fairness. I am sorry that you have found yourself in this situation. But know that you are doing Amila a great favor. He truly has no one else who would be willing to do this for him. He has burned every bridge Amila imaginable. Amila has shamed us It for seems that after years of suffering Amila's embarrassments, Borhal has reached the boiling point. But still, to challenge your brother to a duel. I pray that we will be able to work towards yes. a peaceful resolution before it's too late. I got you your favorite from the meat box. This is it. Shall we begin our duties? Greetings. Are you ready to discuss our rules? Very good. Let us begin. Your primary duty as Amila's second is to work with the brothers and see if a peaceful conclusion is possible. Namely, if Amila apologizes to Borhol and he accepts, the duel may not move forward. As for me, I will be procuring the weapons for the duel, and the materials for the preceding ceremony. Borhol as challenger reserves the right to choose the weapons, and he has chosen blades. Do you have any concerns? Very good. If that is all, we will break here and see to our duties. Before that, though, 
I know that this duel is foolish. I am sorry you got put into this. I will try and find another peaceful solution to this problem. Should you be unsuccessful in convincing them to call it off? Amila has the right to deliver a genuine apology to Borhal, and stop this duel before it commences. The odds of him doing so, however, are low. The Odlum brothers, like their ancestors, are stubborn and prideful. Report back to me when you have spoken with the brothers. We will discuss your secondary duty then. Need help with anything? What is it? I need to prepare. I will do no such thing, and will feel no regrets in avenging Amila's constant dishonors. <sighs> I have given him every chance, every credit. I have begged him to turn himself around, but instead, it has been endless years of dishonor and pain. Damn me. I should have known years ago that this would be the only way things would end. If that is all, you may take your leave. I will not waste your time. I already know what you have come to ask. You wish to inquire if there is any possibility of me apologizing to my brother. The answer is no. The duel shall go forward as planned. It does not matter. An apology is an apology, and I will not humiliate myself like that. Yes, yes I have. I am ready to fight and to die, if that is what the Great Serpent wills. Perhaps Borhal was depending on me being a coward. Perhaps he did not truly believe this duel would go on. Unfortunately for him, I am no coward. to do. How did you fare? Hmm. While disappointing, I am not surprised. Those brothers are stubborn as groats. But you may still have a chance to halt any bloodshed. Listen to me very carefully. Your final duty as a second is to prepare the ceremonial drinks that the duelists will imbibe prior to the duel. As you are preparing the drinks, you will treat each cup with this tranquilizer. Borhal and Amila will be too weak to fight after drinking this. This duel is idiotic, we both know it. 
It is a needless loss of life during a crisis where there is already so much death. And the victor will rue his actions for the remainder of his life. You have one final chance to stop this. Very good. Report to me when you are finished. May the Great Serpent aid us. Cannot wait to be rid of him. How are you handling everything? Is everything ready? Then it is time to begin the duel. Yes, finally. I am ready to do what must be done. The time has come. Amila, are you sufficiently prepared? I am ready. It is time. <sighs> Nothing we can do now but observe and hope for the best. And may the Great Serpent have mercy on your soul, Amila. I am affected as well, dear brother. I, I did not do this. I can hardly see you in front of me. Uh, what the hell is this? What did you do? W what is this? Uh, sabotage! This duel was an asinine idea, Borhal. We put a stop to it. There is no use for needless bloodshed at times like these. We must come together, not kill one another. You traitorous. You betray me, and then you lecture me. Oh, enough of your grousing, Borhal. Your precious duel can wait. Or are you truly so determined to kill me? Enough of your taunting. This is not over. I am counting on that. Remove yourselves. We must rest. But know that you have only delayed the inevitable. Thank the Great Serpent. You did it. The tranquilizer worked and you saved them both. Thank you for trusting me. Nonsense. You've made the right choice. Their eagles are bruised, but deep down they are both relieved. Come what may, we have narrowly avoided a bloodbath today. If they are stupid enough to try again, we will find another way to stop it. 
But I doubt that day will come. Me too. I want to thank you. You trusted me, and because of you, the brothers, my friends, are both alive. They are imbeciles, but better people than they seem. I am grateful for you. Please take this. It is admittedly not much compared to what you would have received if one of them had perished, but... Can you truly put a price on a human life? You are free to go. May the Great Serpent be with you. Always.